Yo, what's poppin' gamers? Welcome back to a brand new Bad Business video. And today we're gonna be checking out the newly revamped M4. This is what the base uh, model's handguard looks like right here. Uh, it is a pretty big change, I won't lie. And then it does have the M16 carry handle, but uh, if you put on a different barrel, that does remove that. A lot of people were saying that this isn't a good revamp and it made the gun look worse. You are crazy for saying that if you're somebody that thinks that. But I don't know, maybe some people really like the much lower poly look. Maybe that's how it is, but this is this is more up to date with our current models that are being put in the game. So it's gotta be updated anyways. Uh, I don't remember what I run on this. I'm pretty sure I usually run a Ranger grip here and this is my build, I think. I don't know, but we got 9,361 kills on this. A lot of you guys have been asking me, did I get a blue diamond yet? No, I was actually waiting for this revamp uh, to release before I got a blue diamond so that there is more hype around this gun. Our eyes looking at uh, like videos with this gun in it. So I planned on waiting until the revamp uh, before I got a blue diamond. So that is why, but expect a blue diamond M4 video soon. Weapon mastery, boom. That's what it's looking like. Actually, I enjoy this much more, so I'm happy uh, with that. Uh, I'd love for you guys to leave some comments down below what your thoughts are on the revamp and stuff. Like I said, I saw a lot of people saying that somehow this made the weapons look worse, which I think is very weird to say, um, but all right. This is literally updated to the current style that the models are being changed into now. I don't know why people are saying that, but whatever. Maybe it's because their precious irons got changed a tiny bit. In my opinion, they look much better. Lighting bug is very annoying. It's very weird that all of a sudden people are just now talking about it. I've been experiencing this for probably the past like six months or so. This uh, weird lighting bug and it's caused by the flashlights. And I chalked it up to a Roblox bug, which it is. Uh, something to do with their lighting uh, that they updated at one point. Yeah, this feels so good. With these irons, this just feels really good. I don't remember if this is exactly what my build was, though. That guy's outfit really blended in with the, the wall there. If you didn't have, like, a scope light on, or the, the glint, whatever you call it, the shine from the scope, I probably wouldn't have seen him, gonna be honest. Also, I've been getting a lot of comments. People ask me to play mobile because it got an update and everything. Guys, I'm not going to play mobile. I could have did it a long time ago when mobile was a problem with his, like, its aimbot and stuff. Back then, I was able to do it because I actually had a setup for that type of thing. But I don't have a setup to do, like, mobile stuff anymore. Maybe in the future I will, but... But it seems like a lot of the mobile people are actually really happy, so... I'm happy you guys got an update because I honestly thought they weren't going to do an update, uh... On that anymore but i'm happy you guys got something also by the way someone said that mobile and pc aren't put together anymore but there's a mobile guy right there so i, I don't know someone said that i was like that doesn't sound right but yeah there's a mobile guy right here also if you guys are wondering where i've been and why i haven't uploaded in a little over a week it's because uh, Model for 2 released. Uh, if you guys have been watching me for a long time, you guys know every single year around Call of Duty time, uh, I get a bit inconsistent. But usually around this time, when I get inconsistent, you get uploads on my other channel. Oh my god, why didn't he shoot me? I don't know. Yeah, but usually you get uploads on my second channel while all that is happening. Uh, since I am playing Call of Duty, uh, which I'll get uploads up on the second channel for Call of Duty stuff here shortly. I just been grinding out my camos, stuff like that. So yeah, expect some uh, videos up on second channel uh, soon. Keep you guys up to date whenever I post on there, whether it's in my community tab or if I let you know within a video. Oh my, hello. There's so many. Yeah, so far this is feeling really good. Uh, nothing's really changed on it with the stuff that I'm using. Uh, only the invader and tactical stuff got some uh, stat adjustments. I think that's the only thing. Uh, but the irons are a little bit different on this, I think. Oh my God, hello. Walking through our spawn, I guess. It's auto lean thing, I probably had to turn off. I do think it's a good feature, but it's gonna get me killed. 
Oh my god, I missed my headshots. Why are you guys here? You're in my spawn. I just spawned here. Oh. Teammate, please. Yeah, dude, this auto leaning thing's messing up my actual lean. It's getting really, it's really weird trying to adjust to this game after playing Mono for two for so long. I knew you were gonna jump down for me. Thankfully, oh, that's an enemy. I thought that was my teammate, dude. He wasn't shooting at me, but I think he was reloading. <laughs> God darn it. Ow, ow, ow. Oh my god, kill me. Kill me, thank you. I need a reset on that ASAP. My aim was so bad there. My sensitivity is not adjusted to my mono for two sensitivity. Now it's gonna be it's gonna feel weird playing that game after I played this game. God darn it. I hate gaming. Dude, just let me give me an option on all games to use like a Microsoft sensitivity thing, right? But in game, you can like switch it to use Microsoft sensitivity, right? That would be great. So we can have one sensitivity across the board, but then you also get into the problems with some Roblox games having a different uh, sensitivity acceleration speed. In my opinion, nobody should adjust that based on, it should just be default Roblox. Arsenal is really known for doing that, by the way. So I really hope with Arsenal 2 that I don't have that problem. But I most likely will. No, dude. I shouldn't have jumped. If I didn't have jumped there, I wouldn't have went around their head. Oh, my God. If I didn't have jumped, they were dead. Yeah, but again, make sure you guys do uh, leave some comments down below your thoughts on... The M4 revamp, also the M16 one, uh, or you can leave or save those opinions uh, whenever we post that video. Hopefully tomorrow. I'll try to get it up tomorrow. God, dude, these irons feel so good. Got him the toes. Out, being shot by everybody. Chill out. Okay. Triple. I don't know what's happening. Teammate, come on, man. You're literally standing behind him. Why would you re-peek? What? This auto lead is going to get me killed, man. I gotta figure out where that setting's at. Ooh. All right, not too bad of a match. 78 and 13, we'll take it. Thank you, thank you. A applaud me, handshake me, mind blown, cold, dead, like, hello? Nobody? Bruh. Alrighty, so my opinions on this is that we got more M4. That That's it. There's nothing special with it. It looks much better. The model looks great. I'm happy with that. Uh, I do like the way uh, the gold is on this barrel specifically. I didn't look at the other ones. Uh, I'm not a fan of this one because it's all gold. Uh, some of you guys might like that. This one doesn't have it. These should be the uh, the blacked out versions right here. I don't know why it's not there. Maybe they forgot to put it on that. And that's when we looked at it already. This one, uh, not a massive fan of this but i do love the way this looks without the gold and then the tactical barrel is all gold but yeah uh the m4 is great uh nothing really changed unless you use the new attachments uh the tactical barrel and and uh invader stock i think it is uh that that got some changes as well but yeah if you guys enjoy the m4 this is a nice little refresher and i will be getting this blue diamond here really soon i don't know if i'm gonna try to do it this week uh, or not, I might wait a week before I do it, uh, since I don't want to do like multiple M4 videos in one week, so it might be a little weird. We'll see though, whatever happens, happens. Tomorrow, I'll try to do a video on the M16 as well. I have no idea what to put on this for a setup. If you guys want to leave a setup down below, maybe I'll try it out. 
Uh, but probably not. I'll I'll figure something out. But yeah, I don't think I'm going to be using this build. But yeah, expect the M16 video tomorrow. I know this video wasn't anything crazy or super exciting. We're probably just going to go back to these casual videos because I don't want to put uh, weeks worth of uh, effort into a video and for it not to do super good or anything like that. And also have people commenting saying they don't like this style. So I'm going to go back to the style that nobody complained about. So yeah, uh, hopefully you guys do enjoy that. Anyways, I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'll see you guys hopefully tomorrow. Peace out.